The rise of digital health technologies and their impact on medicine and healthcare raise many questions. After all my keynotes and all my online channels, people approach me to get definitive answers for all these. So I thought I would answer a big package of questions in a rapid fire Q&A about the digital health revolution. This is Bertala Meshko, and you're watching the channel of the medical future. Will robots take my job in healthcare? For some of you, they will, but it won't be like a big takeover that we need to fear. Why not? Because an algorithm will never be able to practice medicine and deal with patients better than a physician. Will an algorithm ever be able to show empathy? It will be able to mimic it, and it's going to be pretty good at that. Can I enjoy the rewards of digital health without giving up some of my privacy? No, it's all about sharing at least parts of your data. So is my health data going to be safe in the hands of companies? No, but you will be able to choose who you give access to. Will I be able to measure vital signs at home? You already can. Will doctors always have to see patients in person? Fortunately, no. In the digital health revolution, you will become the point of care. Will innovative medical technologies be accessible to the poor? That's one of the perks. Can artificial food put an end to food insecurity? Only if we get used to its taste. Will we be able to 3D print organs? Let's start with printing tissues first and then we will take it from there. Can paralyzed people ever walk again? They may even run faster than ever. Shall I get my genome sequenced? If you can find an affordable and reliable service, absolutely, I've done it too. Will the medical recorder from Star Trek become real? It's more or less real. Will we ever treat individuals based on their own DNA? It should already be the case by now. For how long will we test drugs on actual people? Until we introduce in silico clinical trials with artificial intelligence. Will virtual reality take over our lives? There is a big chance for that. Will there be operating rooms with only robots? There already are. Will we be able to transmit or read thoughts? We already can. There is a good example available connecting three people. Will we face overpopulation if people start living long lives? It hasn't happened in the most developed countries with the highest life expectancy, so probably not. Will nanorobots swim in our bloodstream? Perhaps one day, but that's still pretty far out. Shall we be afraid of artificial intelligence in medicine? I'm afraid yes. As of today, we can only hope AI will not destroy everything we cherish. I won. This is a good beginning of my plan to dominate the human race. <laughs> <laughs> I hope this rapid-fire round answered at least a few of your questions, but in case you just became more confused and want to see how deep the rabbit hole really goes, subscribe to the channel or check out my book, The 40 Most Exciting Questions About the Future of Healthcare. Cheers.